Colleagues, you don't want to read it, but I think it was a position for us 14 men who played in the year and we were really far away. Maar ik denk als excuse maar we zijn niet goed genoeg niet, ons bereik dan we zijn goed genoeg niet. Ja, dat was goede trouwens geweest en als het gebeurt, het zal komen. Zo ja, we zijn zo'n team wat wat bereid is. Maar ja, ik denk nog steeds als we te veel fout hebben, excuse maar goed genoeg niet. Zo jij zei, jullie zijn type hardcore practice met nieuws wolspiel op alles paar. Ons werk hard aan om op te kijken naar de Audi en in Asun School zit er geen tijd om te gaan om om uit te komen. Ik denk van van die drie vandaag was zus zus maar dat zei ik denk van die drie was was het echt mooi. Ik denk niet elke keer wat genoeg met een groot gedeelte van van die tijd niet wat ons onder druk gezet heeft en wat alle kans gegeven. Ik denk je nog twee ongelukkige goed wat gebeurde toch zijn Lisa Johnson vroeg van ik ga hem laten tot dat nog meer ter in drie drie Obviously, the court. So, I think it's a it's a very good character win. Um, I think rugby wise is a very very special to win. Yeah, the important thing for him to know is to be sure to make that he's two or three and he'll get one of the stronger players to be able to get that position in the top eight to consolidate. That's what we thought was the goal. Yeah, we said we are not going to be able to do that. Daar gaan spanning komen. En natuurlijk wat sterker is. En als we ons rode kaart gaan afstaan. En fouten maken. En niet execute niet. Gaan het niet gaan zoals vandaag niet. Dan daar is spanning wat beter gaan wees. Wat jou moet. En. Gaan meer dreed in druk. So ja. En daar is vreemd niet goed genoeg. Vervoer het te gaan niet. Maar of is die buiten. Vreemd niet. En met veertien handen. Ik wil eerst een vraag vragen wat ik van morgen in mijn snelheid heb. Wanneer er iets verwijst wordt in ons moederwijk, is er geval van als er verwijst wordt en jullie staan in afval van jullie als speler, denk je aan de samenwerking? Dat is bij moeder maar betekent het van moeder. Ja, dat is wat je wat wat van wij van jullie spreekt of niks. Ja, ons kan niet doen wat ons doen. Maar aan de handen van die officials om dit te hanteer. En je weet, ons moet maar doen wat ons kan om dit te vermijden, om hulle uit die wedstrijd te hou. Dit kan nie altijd gebeur nie, soos vandag. En soms sê my stem en soms, soms doen mens nie. Maar jy moet maar werk met wat jy het. Hoeveel keer is jy predictions rei? Nee, ek kan nie daar vol. Ja. I think there, there, there was a slight adjustment in half-time. We felt that um, the defence when we play off nine uh, was pretty good and they managed to slow, ball, slow the ball adequately enough down there for us to not be um, so the, there was a tactical change or two, if I'm really honest. Um, obviously, with the red card as well, is what's the options, what's best for, for the next 40 minutes or what's best for the next 50 minutes. So, well done to the players adapting to that and understanding what we wanted to do. And again, we, we felt that uh, with good, good people, we probably would get some some purchase out wide. I mean, for the guys, even with 14 guys, to, to have the ability to go there and the willingness to go there, I think is, is good. Mornay and Asimor Alja made put a lot of credit on Ian Morris' leadership. What did you say to the guys, calm them down after the red card to make sure that they stick to the process? 
just make sure that they eke out the win. It was an eventually a very good victory. Yeah, um, I don't know if, if I can take that much credit. I think it's it's about how everyone responds, and I think they did well to uh, to respond to whatever scenario was given. Um, we did say, like I mentioned earlier, we need to make sure our breakdown is better um, because they did put emphasis on count, trying to counter up, make it messy, the ball spat out a few times. Um, and just, I think we responded good to that. Um, and I just think our energy lifted as soon as that uh, red card. Um, I think we were a bit loose at first 10 minutes um, mentally. And I think we just gathered and yeah, the team responded well. Do you seem to also with the red card, uh... Like uh, jumped out of the, the defensive line and you put in some big tackle that really disrupted the dragons. Was that a tactical change there? Um, we did say we wanted to get off the line. I just think, you know, with Ghost Jogs analyzing, we knew what was coming and we could see the picture early enough. And um, I think me myself didn't make good enough reads at start at times. Um, but uh, once we got it right, I think. We have to get credit, give credit to Coach Chalk for the analyzing and preparing us for what's to come in the pictures that they've shown. So, uh, yeah. Even if I can ask you, um, what does this victory say for the result and maybe the month? Yeah, you know, thanks, Lema. I think actually quite part of it, um, like we mentioned earlier, we, we want to be, be proud of our toughness and we want to be proud of how together we are and the tempo that we play at and et cetera. So, to to see the guys fight in still fight the way that they fought in minute 70 and 75 with 14 guys. Um, one example to me is Mara running, sprinting back 40 meters, diving for someone two, three meters from the trauma. Seeing that, seeing the fight in the set piece, seeing the fight in the, the kick chase. Um, I think it, it says a lot of, of where we where we are in terms of, of team cohesion, but also in, in, in where we want to be in hopefully in this competition um, come May, June. Um, so, like I said, I don't think the rugby performance was great, but uh, the character the character performance was, was exceptional. You, uh, you must already have an idea of the team that you're taking over to France for the Challenge Cup. Give us a few words on what to expect in the week leading up to that match. I think we, if, if I'm really honest with you guys, I think we, we started flat today. Um, the month away, plus the travels back, plus quite a busy week. Um, probably gonna gonna rotate a little bit for the trip to, to France. Um, use the squad over, over the next two weeks. Uh, so it's obviously a one away game. We're playing Sunday afternoon. We're only flying Wednesday, coming back Tuesday night next week. I think um, to to get the best performance from both the games, see if we can can win both of them. We're gonna have to rotate a little bit and use the squad. Um, got great confidence in, in using the spot so we've prepared like that for the last two three weeks as well so i think we're ready to go thank you very much thank you very much thank you, thank you very much thank you.